demonstrating the Cryo Success Cryotherapy Unit. I will be demonstrating the use of the product on a common skin lesion. Firstly, I'll demonstrate the Cryo Unit with current tip applied, which is a one millimeter cryotherapy tip, which would be most useful for most common small lesions. And just to make mention that there is another size tip, which is a four millimeter for larger lesions if required. There is also another product that can be also applied to the end of the cryo success which can be used for um, gynecological procedures um, with lesions affecting the cervix and also the vaginal walls. But today I'll be using the one millimeter tip on the cryotherapy unit. So just to demonstrate the assembly, um, so this is the metal pin that inserts into the side of the cryotherapy unit, the cryo unit which then allows you to stabilize the unit to screw in the cryotherapy cylinder, the gas cylinder, to prevent any damage to the trigger at the top of the cryo unit. So with firm pressure, twisting the cryotherapy cylinder in until you can't twist any further, and then you're removing the metal pin. And now the unit is ready to be used for treatment of a lesion. So as mentioned before, I'm gonna demonstrate the use of the cryo success on a common skin lesion and just in terms of holding the product I use it just like I would a pen holding it like that with my index finger on the trigger. So the main advantage of the cryo success is that you're applying direct pressure to the, to the wound or to the lesion and ideally it's sort of 90 degrees. So applying direct pressure and plunging the trigger three, four, five, and you're achieving your cryotherapy burn to treat the lesion. After use, I recommend applying the plastic stopper just to protect the end of the cryo success needle. And in removing the cylinder, placing the metal pin back in and with quick firm release of the cylinder, releases and is ready for a use at another stage. The other thing to mention about the cryo success is the fact that um, it has a the the tip is able to be cleaned just with a simple alcohol wipe. Um, but if you do come in contact with bodily fluids, you're able to sterilise the tip with the cryo unit, obviously separate to the actual cylinder, which should not be used in uh, sterilising. So now you know how to use the cryo success. Um, happy freezing.